let's talk about salmon. Mm. Now, if you've got the opportunity and you do have some left over, if not, you do the great deals that are enough where you can buy one and get a pack free and you think, oh, I'm going to bung it in the freezer. If not, use it in a different way. Okay. Cook it, it will last longer and you can transform it into some Ooh. fabulous food. Great. Right, so to kick off, let's talk about potatoes bravas or potatoes. Mm, now, really, if you're having a dinner and you have got some potatoes left over, or you cook, I'm saying, cook a little bit more. Right. Refresh them, put them in the fridge, chop them up, touch the sunflower oil, look at that. Crispy, crispy potatoes. So, so simple, not hard to do at all. Okay, now we need a good sauce base for this. In here, we've got some tomatoes, a touch of chilli, and some tomato puree. I'm just going to add some olive oil to it. Whack on the lid and you basically just blitz it up. I've got myself a little blitzer here. On that goes. Give it a blitz round and then we put it through a sieve right. and it goes, if I show you the two different colours, the oil will make it go lovely, silky, ah, smooth. Like okay, that. so That's so good. so simple. Right, now onto the star of the dish, the salmon. Touch of salt and pepper on some skinless, boneless salmon pieces. Okay? Bit of oil on there, a non-stick pan. It's going to take about 30 seconds Yeah, it takes no time at all. Exactly, yeah. yeah, just to cook it. Just going to do enough now for one. Add a tiny bit more oil to the pan. And I just wash my hand off because I touched the, uh, the raw salmon. Sure. OK, now, so we've got the potatoes bravas on the go. We've got the, uh, the, the lovely, rich, sumptuous, silky smooth piquant, I could say, <gasps> because of a touch of chilli in there, yeah? <laughs> that kind of oil. The salmon almost uh, literally cooked through, it's that quick. Turn it over, as you can, like that, in the hot oil. OK, that's looking grand. OK, now, middle pan here, look at this, I've got some onions and garlic mm. that have just started to cook down and take on a little bit of colour and soften. Mm. To that, I've got some cooked green beans. Well, that's a good idea, make the green beans interesting. Yeah, basically, like it's, it's, a, it's an old-school fricassee dish, oh. this one. And all we're going to do is roll it for about 20 seconds in that hot oil. I added a little bit of salt then, just to right. check. OK, right, so... And is that it? Yeah, this is coming together. Now, tapas you eat individually. Yes. I think this eats really well together as well. Mm. So I'm going to do a little pile of them off to one side. We'll just check that salmon again. Almost there, almost good. OK, one more bit there, turn them over. There we go. OK. Now, get the beans. Yep. A few of them on the side. It's really quick, isn't it? Yeah, big time, this one. A few beans, and then we've got the uh, we've got the wonderful silky smooth sauce, like I said. Oh, and the potatoes, I love that. Onto the potatoes. On your holidays, it's really good, is that? Definitely, but it's got that wonderful mm. pick. OK, right. Now, let's get that over there. Touch of um, some black sesame. Oh! Adds crunch. Now, with regards yeah. to the salmon, a bit of lemon over the top. Shake it up. This is gorgeous. It looks so, so nice. It's just so, so simple. Now, yeah. tapas, obviously, it would be in between. Yeah. But you give that one a go. Ah, let me see, let me see. Let you me could see. have the beans as a I'm side lemon. dish, the bravas on their own. Mm. Salmon's so simple. Mm. Lemon. Boom. That's what Boom. I like. Boom. It goes. 